little Viking. Welcome to my video. Hey everyone. We just got our free games this month, and there's one called Counter Spy, which is actually really, really cool. So I thought I'd show you some of it. I'll start a new game, even though it said continue there. But you can see at the top, I'm at the beginning. What you need to do is get these launch plans from either the Americans, I think, or the Russians. So you choose a level you want. Uh, what do we do? What do this one? It's got four formula pages. Then you choose weapons, which you unlock as you go. I've already got a couple, so I'm going to start with my normal pistol and the silence pistol. I've already bought my things. Then you get these formulas. Let's see, this is like... Enemy gunfire and explosions cause 40% less damage. They're tricked into lowering their DEFCON by one. Security is less effective. I can run without getting here. Heard. So yeah, there's loads of cool things that you can unlock to make it easier. And each level is like random. They randomly generated levels. And you got to sneak through getting the plans, but it's just really, really cool. Stuff I haven't seen done in a 2D side scroller before, which I just think is wicked. And the style of the cutscenes and stuff, that's all great. It reminds me of The Incredibles. Uh but yeah, you're just this spy. As you see that guy there, you can tell the direction he's facing. You want to sneak up on him moving slowly. And take him out without getting seen. That little thing on the top right, that's your map. And you pretty much want to get all the way to the right side. And there you can take their launch plans and lower their DEF CON. You can aim your Oh, so I was spotted, but I managed to get him before he signaled an alert. These fill up your ammo when you get to them, which is good. Hey, this is cool. You can do a. You can hang from the side and do silent takedowns. Oh, he's not getting close enough. Ah, oh, I have to sneak up. Oh, I was too loud, he heard me, but oh well. That means I won't get my stealth bonus. Stealth combo, get loads of points. But this is really cool. You take cover on the wall, and you can then aim down the corridor, so it's not just... It's not quite, like, just the 2D game. It's got a little bit more to it. I'm not sure if you have to kill all the people, but if they see you or spot you at all, they will phone up and lower the DEFCON, or raise the DEFCON. See, the DEFCON starts at 3, and he can go, its lowest is 5, but if it reaches 1, they'll start launching their nukes, and that's the last thing you want. So you have to go through the levels, keep getting the plans, keep getting the formula, keep getting the new weapons, until you've got them all. But if in that time you get spotted enough times or killed enough times that your DEFCON is lower to one, they'll start launching their nukes. And that's game over and you have to start again. I'm not doing very well at all this first time. My health is really low. But yeah, I just like how it's different every time. It doesn't get boring. It seems that they can only really actually see you if they're on the screen at the same time as you. Even if you take cover like this and you see them all the way over there in the back, they'll still see you because you can see them. Which is a bit poo, but whatever. I like that. You see the little chemical bottle on there. That means it's got a formula page in it. I didn't do very good this time at all with not getting seen. You can see I've only got 1,250 points so far. There's a trophy for getting 10,000 in a level, and I've got nowhere near that. My most is like 2,500 or something. Oh, 
And it may look pretty easy, but it's the very first level on the easiest mode. There's then a normal and hard mode, but I haven't been able to unlock yet. You need to complete it before doing that. <coughs> but there's a complete it without continuing trophy. And I think I got all the way up to the last level without continuing. But on the last level I had to continue, so... I thought I'd start again and see if I can get that. There was also a complete a level without getting seen trophy, which is actually a lot harder than it looks. I've tried that quite a few times and not managed to do it. But you see that, that was a little secret area. With another formula page, that's cool. Signal scrambling. Good thing to do is just take him out quickly. Oh god. Whoa. Whoa, he was strong. But you can also get a lot heavier weapons, like uh I've got a shotgun and an assault rifle. But I am trying to do it a bit more stealthy. Also got a tranquilizer gun. Oh, I think I've got a silent shotgun as well, so I might be able to try that at some point soon. I am running out of ammo for my silenced pistol, which you do have to refill every level. Other than this, I've only got a normal pistol, which makes noise. See over there is a red box. If I shoot that, I'll quickly get it before they see me. Now, they're alerted to an explosion, but I don't think they're alerted to me. So it might be okay. Oh, he's, he's calling them. He's raising the death gun. Oh, God, I died. But that's fine, because you just start the room back with the DEFCON raised one more. Change to my other pistol now. There's only one person in the room. It doesn't matter if I get hurt. There we go. And there it is, there's the big computer you have to find in every single level. When you do that, this will end the level, so make sure you've got everything before you continue. Or everything that you want to get. We've done it, we've done it! Yeah, this game's wicked. And it's just basically that. It gets harder, harder enemies, more weapons, more ways of doing things. And you see that their death gone's down on two now, is up at two now, and theirs is still three. So it means this might be easier, because I can get seen more. Hmm, and it's got three launch plans, whereas this one only has two. Two officers present. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. I'll show you about officers. I'll refill my ammo, because I want my silence pistol. Even though I can't afford my tranquilizer gun just yet. So yeah, we'll save up for the trank and keep going at the with the silence pistol for now. Day two time. Oh, this guy's an officer, which means you can kill him, but if you let him look at you and you hold a gun up to him while there are no other enemies around he'll lower the defcon but i think it does count as getting seen because he goes into a little alert before he surrenders is he going to turn around? i'm scared Oh, <laughs> he shot me still. I had to make a little bit of noise so he noticed me and turned around. Which means I won't get this complete without getting seen. As if I would have anyway, but... Roshnikov. They're pretty far apart. I could probably take them out without getting seen. There you go. There, you see a stealth 2 bonus in the corner. Top right. That just keeps going up and up until you get seen. Cameras don't mind about dead bodies. They're not really alert to that kind of thing. Oh, 
there. It's going okay at a minute. I see a secret to the left there. Always keep an eye out for them little things, because... Oh, like this. I've got a weapon part, and maybe some money in the little one next to it. Yeah, so that was a good secret. There's no way I'm going to get 10,000 points in this level. It never happens. Wait, was I just up here? What an idiot. Dumb. Maybe I can get him before he sees me. Got him. Yeah, nice. Okay, there's a guy over there to the left. He's not facing the right way. Oh, I can get him. Cool, cool. Alright. It's going well. We've got a times 8 combo. That's good. Will we get this 10,000 points in the level? That'd be wicked. I see it'd probably be easier to get it later on in the game, seeing as there's more enemies who are, like, worth more to kill. I don't know if I want to kill this guy or or make the DEFCON go down, because I'll be able to keep the combo up. But... Oh, wait, I need to kill this guy before I do that. Is this the only guy left? Yeah, you got to make sure you kill everyone before you take down the officers. Yeah, that it lowered my score, even though I did a perfect capture of him, really. There was no way that could have gone better, so... Yeah, if you want to keep up the stealth combo, I guess you have to shoot them. Or get them without them seeing you. Darn. Oh, someone heard it. Okay, that still counts as being in stealth, even if they radio back. So that's not too much of a problem, just kill them before they do it. But you see the little red bar around the five? That will go up as they're on the radio to headquarters. And if it reaches all the way around, it will the DEF CON will then be raised again. And you don't want that happening. Oh, what happens if I land on this guy's head? Oh, <laughs> Wait, was that stealth? Did he did he see me? Oh, I lost my combo. I think he saw me. Don't land on their heads. Oh god, that was close. Oh, there's two of them. <laughs> hey. Oh, that nearly killed me. I was so close to that. Even. <gasps> Someone's coming. Someone coming. Well. Oh, he must be in the room to the side. We're in the gut. Here we go. Weapon thing. Are we getting a new weapon? The final negotiator. Five out of six. This hasn't been a bad level. There's been loads of money about. Loads of good stuff. Two more rooms to do. What will they be? Oh, there's an ammo locker. That's good. That's good. We're low on ammo. Save us some money. There you go. Look at that. That's cool. Anyway, I saw this game in the PlayStation Store quite a lot in the past. I was. It's been in there for a while. I've looked at it a few times, but it never really captivated me. I never really wanted to play it. I looked at videos and I looked at all the screenshots and stuff, but it didn't even really look that good. But after playing it, you can see that it is really, really cool. The pictures don't do it justice. And for a free game, that's actually brilliant. Look!
yeah, I normally struggle with these big rooms to not get seen. There's always the last rooms as well. I found it really hard trying to go through without getting spotted. That trophy's difficult. Unless there's some better weapons and formula I find later on which will help out. But we'll see. There we go. Done them. Cool. I reckon that's what I'm going to show you for now. I'll probably do a couple more videos soon. But yeah, that's just Counter Spy. A little introduction. Yeah, I love this game. And if you're part of PlayStation Plus, download it now. And if you're not part of PlayStation Plus, buy it now. It's actually really good. And if you like it, you, you should watch other things that I do. Because that was good, wasn't it? Admit it. In this image, the squares labeled A and B appear to be different shades. They contrast, seemingly bound by juxtaposition. <laughs> Landed face first, but I made it. So it's not too bad. And come back down to the car park, grab one of the lovely cars and get out of there. Now is the time for you to subscribe! Ha ha ha!